I am going to show you how to reset Windows 10 when the computer is still booting up to Windows. This option will delete all your files. If you have important files, please back them up or transfer them externally before proceeding. Once this process is done, it will be like when you first got the computer. You have to set up all over again. The three most common reasons why people reset their machine to its factory defaults are Number one, when they are not satisfied with the performance of their computer or it's slow. Two, the computer is infected with a virus, malware, adwares, or pop-up windows. And three, they want to start the computer fresh with a new user or owner. Okay, so let's start. Open Settings. Click on Update and Security, click on Recovery, under the Reset this PC section, click the Get Started button. Or, to get through with this option right away, you can just simply type on the word Reset on the search box right next to the Windows icon. Usually, it is located at the bottom left side of your screen. Once you type in Reset, it will give you a result of Reset this PC, then click on that. Click the Remove Everything option. Click on Next. Click the Reset button and you're good. Make sure that the machine is plugged in, meaning the charger needs to be connected so that there won't be any interruption during the reset process because usually that will last for 15 to 45 minutes. If that process is interrupted, the operating system or your Windows 10 might be corrupted. If it's corrupted, you will be needing a recovery media like a disk or a USB. Soon, I will be discussing on how to create a recovery media on your end. You can also check my other videos on how to reset your device when a computer is not booting up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Thank you. Over and out.